Hello fellow gear whores. Today I have the 511 Tactical Expert Multicam Tactical Pant. This is more like a combat pant. I first saw these at SHOT Show and I knew I absolutely needed to have them. These are probably the most advanced pant in terms of design and features that 511 has ever put out in my opinion. So let's get started. We got a button closure here. That's also uses Velcro, so if you need to quickly go on and off, you don't need to worry about buttoning it or not. <clears throat> zipper fly, unknown brand of zipper, it's not labeled, it just says 511 on it. Belt loops, nice large belt loop for all kinds of riggers belts, duty belts. The waist is adjustable, so even if you don't want to wear a belt, you can take this kind of G-hook here and tighten it up nice like it has a nice elastic pull to it and that's on both sides the front hand pockets here are really big you can see my hands just get swallowed up in there so there's no front small pockets like other combat pants this one actually has on top of the cargo which the cargo pockets are actually pretty wide a slash pocket on both sides and this is plenty for a large phone or a similar size device let me go to the the leg here yeah these cargo pockets are gigantic as you can see here now what's cool about them is instead of using velcro or any kind of button it actually utilizes magnets which is pretty cool so quickly on and off you get into your pocket and you can just drop the flap and they'll close the pockets also expand as well as so you can see it has these pleats there for expansion inside of the pocket we have two organizers for magazines you also have this keeper here so if you want to tie in like a GPS unit or something else you don't want to lose you can tie it in there keys and whatnot and that's the same on both sides going down the pant you can use knee pads, of course. The knee pad pocket is accessible through the front. Simply unvelcro it and pull the knee pad out. It's a nice thick foam. Nice aggressive angles there, and it's already angled for your kneecap. These come with the pant, which is pretty nice. Don't have to buy them separately. Really easy to put them on and off. That's for both knees. And you can see the knee has extra fabric, so when you take a squat or a kneel, your knee fills in that pocket. The bottom of the pant, towards the cuff, you do have another pocket there near your ankle. Also, magnetic closure. Pretty cool on both sides. On the cuffs, you do have a interior pull here. So if you want to blouse your, your boots, pull it in and give it a little knot. Kind of surprised there isn't a cuff reinforcement portion here. It's just all just one layer. Quick note too, on the hand pocket, it is reinforced for your knife clip. Going to the back. Like pretty much every other combat pant now using the stretch fabric here. So if you wearing a belt and this is up on your waist, you want to bend over, take a knee. The pant stays glued to your body and flexes to your body, which is nice. Back to rear pockets. Also magnetic closures. Good size pocket. You 
you can see from the crotch here also has that stretch fabric so if you're gonna bend over squat take a knee the pant stays with you and flexes to your body which is really nice One little thing here too on the cargo pocket, you can see it has a elastic there. So when you open it up, it gets the, even the opening gets pretty large too, along with the the pleated cargo pocket. On the interior here, let's open this up. The waistband has a spacer mesh here, which is pretty nice. Feels pretty good. You can see the tags are still on here, so I really want really worn this pant once just to around the house trying it out, seeing how the fit, how the feel is. And this does feel pretty nice around your weight, especially if you have a thick belt on there with a holster and some magazines. Let's go ahead and turn it the leg inside out. So you can see here is your knee pad pocket with the flex breathable material. This is your stretch fabric combined with some thicker fabric here. Now the fit of the pant is pretty relaxed. So you could wear base layers with it. It runs really true to size. So you may even want to size down. It's not aggressively fit or cut at all. So it fits pretty good. I normally wear 34, 32, and these fit fit just great. Um, I do wish that the legs had some adjustable straps here so I can tighten up the leg a little bit. It doesn't have that. Um, also doesn't have the, you can pull the knee up and down, which is not really super necessary, but I do like having the straps in the back to tighten up the legs a little bit if it's a little too baggy. Again, I mean, I, I, I'm for 5'11. I have a few of their pants. In terms of features, this is probably the most advanced pant I've ever seen them release, which is pretty impressive. It also comes with a pretty steep price point. These are about 270 bucks at full retail, so they're quite, quite expensive. But it's got tons of features, so that's up to you guys. One thing too, also, it, it's kind of hard to see because it's, it's camo. But you also have these cutouts here. So if you want to use other type of knee pads that drop on top and the straps go in between, they are integratable with those kind of knee pads. Again, this is the 511 Tactical Expert Multicam Tactical Pant. I would say more of a combat pant than a tactical pant because the features on this pant may be a little too much for a traditional um, tactical duty wear. Thanks for watching. If you like our videos, be sure to subscribe. We got plenty more coming. If you have a comment or question, leave it below. We'll do our best to answer it.